Hi all and welcome to this video about loading and saving files in Ecamm. In this video I will quite simply go over how to load and then how to save files. Loading and saving files in Ecamm happens in the configuration section. Press this arrow here to show load and save file options. And to load a file, I just press choose file. My, uh, my choose file button is in German, but it'll be in a different language for you probably. And then I can choose a file. So maybe this wastewater treatment plant I have here and open it. And now I have it in Ecamm. And if I go to the inventory, you can see that I have some data entered for treatment and collection, as well as some results already there. One very important thing to note with loading files is that you have these two options, replace and append. Replace will delete any file I have here and put the file that I'm loading, whereas append will create a list. And again, what's very important is to make sure that you select the option that you want before you actually load the file. So if I want to add something to the list and not replace it, I have to first click append, choose the file, here I'll choose this second wastewater treatment file and I'll open it and you see I have two different assessments going at the same time and I can access the inventory of both of those assessments. To save the file I just click the save file button. Saving is so important like I've said in other videos Ecamm does not save any of the files or any information online so you need to be saving it locally anytime you change something or, or want to use the file again. So I can just save the file and it's important to note that the file will save with both of the assessments or all of the assessments in it and it'll also be named that way so it'll always be the assessment plus assessment. If you have three it would be plus another assessment. Okay well I hope that this video was helpful and that you all check out other videos if you have more questions.